All right, this video, we're gonna talk about catfish. This is a, a fish that we don't talk about very often. Just, uh, just caught one on a little jig. But as far as how to unhook these, these are, you know, these are saltwater catfish. These spines are, are very sharp and they hurt very, very badly if you get uh, spined by them. So a lot of people will, will just not touch the catfish and try to use pliers and shake it off. I highly recommend against that because when, you, when you're shaking it off, you lose control and no telling where that fish is going to land. Sometimes it'll, it'll come off in your direction. I've seen it happen multiple times where people get pinned after the, the, the fish has, has gone off the lure and gravity will either hit their leg or hit their arm. The best thing to do is, is grab them and I'll show you how. First thing, I like to just secure the hook or the jig, whatever, whatever you have them by. That way, as it shakes, it, uh, it can't get you. And what I like to do is I go from underneath. I, the, these, this spine is very sharp. And so I like to get them, get them agitated. And then I, I get two fingers below the spine, below those pins, and then, and then one above and just grab on tight. So now it can't, it can't hurt me no matter what, right? So the, the parts to watch out for are the top one and the two sides. And once you hold them like this, they can't do anything. You have 100% control. Now you can just take the hook out. And then as far as releasing it, you know, I just simply just put it upside down, flick it off. And it's got and it's done, it's gone. No harm done. But that's the safest way that I found to release them. I've caught a bunch of catfish over the years. I've still never been spined by them because I just go ahead and grab them. The times I, I've actually come close to getting to getting barbed is when I'm using the pliers or using using the, the line trick where you wrap the line over. I, I don't recommend for catfish. Just grab them, grab them just like that. And as long as you're careful, just make sure that you control the head before you reach in there. It can't be flopping around too much. If you do that properly, you will never get spined by them. You won't have to worry about it. You'll just get a little bit of slime on your hands and uh, that can be just wiped off with, uh, with the old rag. But I just wanted to share with you uh, that at least the way that I've found to work best to get those catfish off safely. If you do have any other method, you know, please do leave a comment down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts and I'm sure others would, uh, would, would as well. So leave a comment down below if you have any. Otherwise, thank you so much for your time. Hope you can get on the water soon. Catch the big ones. There's something about the water that'll give you peace All by yourself or with your family Live salt strong and wear the line today